luck, Coach. Thank you. Good luck. NBA win on three. One, two, three. Win! Let's go! Yeah! Jog up! to start by giving credit to our opponent. They're a much, much better team than the team we played last year. Um, they were very well coached and they've got some real good players on their team. I think what hurts the most is we were in a position to win this one and we came up a little bit short. I know as coaches we're going to go back and look at every single thing that we did from first quarter to the fourth to find out how we could have done a better job of putting our guys in a position uh, to win this one. It hurts, but we think we're a better team than what we showed. and. Hopefully, it'll be better next week. A lot of mistakes kind of hurt, hurt you. What, what, what's the most disappointing part about the turnovers and, and penalties and all that? Yeah, um, self-inflicted wounds uh, really do hurt you. It's hard enough when you play against a, a good, well-coached team to win a ball game. It's even harder if you if you make mistakes. And so, a couple of turnovers really hurt. I thought that first turnover in the first quarter really crushed the momentum. We came out, took the ball, wanted to build a little confidence, went the length of the field and scored a touchdown and had momentum, we're in scoring position again, and unfortunately gave it back to them, shifted the momentum. We got it back uh, near the end of the game. I uh, had a lot of guys dinged up that were coming in and off the field. Uh, we need to do better at job as coaches to tell them to lay down and not leave the field without telling us because that cost us a couple timeouts and disrupted our offense a little bit. But uh, the offense put up a lot of points. I thought uh, Coach Max called an excellent game. Um, we had a lot of new starters in there uh, that probably got some of the butterflies out early with some of those uh, penalties with the snap, but we'll, we'll get better. Um, that's For us, that's putting up a lot of points, a lot more than last year. I think we got out of position a couple times on defense and gave them big-time explosive plays. Those are things I think we can correct. Too late to do it today.
what went into the decision to um, put Jacob Sermon in? Uh, trainers told us Dylan had to be removed from the game, so we removed him from the game. First game of the year, it's, what's your message to the team so you don't let this team, this loss define you for the rest of the year? What's, what's your message to the team right now? Oh, every single time we get an opportunity to take the field, it's a blessing. And our guys compete it to the bitter end. It wasn't good enough to win. We got beat by a better team today. Um, but we know that we're better than what we showed, and we're going to keep going back to the drawing board and working hard. And we still love this game and love each other, and we're going to come out and compete next week. What to say about your team at the end? You had a chance to win, but just another turnover cost a mistake. But, but you, you had, you had a, your team never gave up here today. Yeah, I tell you what, it was looking grim, and our, our team kept fighting, and we inched our way back into a position to win the game, and we were oh so close. That's why it, this one hurts so much, because you go back and look at every single little call, every single little play that we could have made, and everybody points the finger at themselves. That's the only way to get better. So that's what we'll do. We'll be really uh, self-critical when we watch the film, and we'll we'll get back after it tomorrow. Can you give any additional details on David Hogue? Yeah, David Hogue uh, will probably be out for a while, re recovering from a knee injury. I don't know exactly how long, but he'll be out for a while. Thank you. Thanks. The result that you wanted. What are some of the lessons that you're going to take away from this game? Go ahead. Um, I think a lot of it is just not overlooking teams and making sure that we stay disciplined throughout the week. Um, we're definitely going to work as hard as ever for this next week. And I mean, I think we did great today on both sides of the ball. It just comes down to execution and minor MAs, and that's things that we're going to work on and we're going to fix. So looking forward to next week, turn the page on this one. So, How do you not let this define your season and kind of bounce back from this moment? Uh, say it again. How do you, how do you let this... Don't let this uh, loss, first game to find your season, bounce back from a, a loss like this. Uh, because we still have one goal, and our goal is to be Big Sky champions. You know, and we're still 0-0 uh, in the Big Sky. You know, nobody's won the Big Sky yet, so we're just gonna keep working. Uh, we just gotta make sure we don't uh, start out slow like we did, and we just gotta keep keep the same pace that we know how to how, how to do, and just we just gotta keep playing our ball. Yep. What's it say about your team at the end there, just to to have resilient, not give up, and and try to make a, a good effort at the end there? Uh, that's just how we play. You know, that's how we've been working all summer. We've been we've been working to get through adversity. You know, when a guy goes down, the next guy's up. And you guys seen that a lot throughout the game. Yep. You know, a lot of our guys stepped up to, to help influence the, the way, the, the outcome of the game, you know, but we just fell short. So we just got to keep working. What was the biggest challenge that they presented to y'all? Uh, the biggest challenge that they presented to us defensively is uh, their coverage. They're, they're very good in coverage, you know, and, you know, I – I personally, I didn't want to. I didn't want to underestimate them. They're 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 a really good team, so I give them props on their defense. A lot of mistakes kind of hurt you. What's it? How does how do those hurt, and how do you hope to correct those moments so they don't, they don't happen again? Um, I think they just hurt by like field position and everything. Someone like you get a flag, brings us back, you know, and I think it just sets us back in that way. Um, and then what was the other part of the question? Just kind of what was your t what was your coach's message, kind of? moving forward from here just I mean like like dot said oh no and the next page turn the page and move forward and I think we had a great performance today so it's just really looking to the next week and pre uh, preparing as hard as we can and just keep staying resilient